Oh man, you hear the to. drum roll, sometimes the melody. Sometimes motherfuckers even go so far taking the whole damn melody. <laughs> motherfucker might steal the bass line or a certain way that nigga do a certain drum roll. Fucking right. Man, hell yeah, the first <laughs> eight bars and the side, the first like, four bars damn. of that shit. That producer, a lot of times, don't really last too, too long. But everybody motherfucking bite, because they got a lot of the older producers that's lost, and they can't find it no more. That's why nigga don't send motherfucking beat CDs. Oh, Because no. niggas be studying what? the nigga shit, man. Like fashion. You got some motherfuckers don't know what direction to go with a sneaker. Got to the point where a motherfucker start biting the whole Air Force One pattern. Well, you got some companies who start doing some shit that look like shell toe. Some niggas try to do shit that start looking like Reebok. It's like motherfuckers be trying to find out what, what's going to be in this quarter. What's going to be in this year. So what they do is sit back and see what another motherfucker doing. Instead of just being an innovator and just coming out with a style. That's why I give respect to the Neptune, to Kanye. But you know, you got, you got a lot of innovators, man. It's a long list of them. But... It's a long list of niggas who really just sit back and wait to see what a motherfucker gonna do. And other niggas, you might see their name one time on a project, but you don't see the shit no more. Because you would be like, ah, damn, this sound like, that shit sound just like tomb shit. Yeah. Oh, that shit sound like some no limit shit. That sound like, you know, Kino shit. Now here, we speed samples up. We slow a few of them down, but we still put our down south shit to it. We, we know how to just grab shit and make nothing out of something. You know what I mean? You got to force yourself you to be, be creative. creative. You know what I'm saying? You and got you're to. a producer, producers are, we the ones who create. You know what I'm saying? So if you ain't got no creativity, you can't call yourself a producer. You know what I'm saying? Because we putting this shit together before it even get to the artist. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. And it start from your sounds, man. You can't just buy a sound module and just go through the sounds and make beats and say you got a, you're a producer and you just good. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You got to get in that motherfucker, create some different sounds. That's where it started. If you hear a beat and it sound like something you ain't never heard before and it sound good, it's because them sounds are some shit you ain't heard. Damn right. Brand new shit. Now, I mean, Timberland, that's what you do. Timberland make, Timberland make his own sound. Sometimes you got to get them get in the microphone and yeah. do, do whatever weird ass sound you used to do when you was a kid and your mom say, stop doing that shit. Put that motherfucker in the right keyboard and fuck with the envelopes. And that's a whole nother level. And them that's drums got to be hitting. And the drums got to be hitting. Yes, Definitely. Sir. For more on this Raw Report news clip, visit news.rawreport.com.